Welcome back to the channel. Reactions, rants, rabbit holes, and I uh, actually I had one opened up for me here because I didn't. I had to do a little research, and uh, I didn't know Phil, so I didn't know about him through his music. I, I watched him on a regular. Follow Phil on Twitter, oddly enough, but I just I never I never filled in the gaps. So. I now know not to make any references to the mall. Like, <clears throat> I'm a Shadows Fall fan, but oddly enough, after going down some uh, information, I'm going to put some All That Remains on the, the channel and see if uh, what I think of that. that uh, God, I could have sworn they came through the club when I worked there. And I'm just trying to say as I... I was a little confused on a lot of stuff and now I have a better grasp of uh, some information and I'm curious what this is going to be because uh, yeah, Middle of Road, Mellow on the last two Tim Cast tunes. Well, let's see what Bright Eyes is all about. the heavy part that it kicks into i mean it's chill obviously the yeah you know the catalog of latin reactions i have on the channel speaks volumes to you know <clears throat> i think it's cool i think the best part of this is it doesn't make me think of the other things tim does at all it stands by itself i don't watch this and think of some indictment or celebration of some right news story or something else that he does right i i, I don't it, it's just a band making music is it my number one favorite style of music nah, hell no but does it anywhere taint me with ideas of like they say the other part of yeah i think it's separate from i think that's fucking cool that it, it stands by itself it doesn't let's say this in my secret fanboy world, right? I'd want it to be all crazy politically charged, all this stupid. I would love that. I'd eat it right up. But we don't need that. That already exists. Sounds like this band makes music for what they want to make music for. I can respect that all by itself, even if it's not what I'm going to, you know, put on my current Let's Go playlist. So, uh, I like where it kicks in. I think I think it covers my bases. And outside of the beanie, I mean, I wouldn't know no better.
on me. Our bright eyes are looking at the doomsday clock there. See, it did. I had no clue until, uh, you know, they blew some shit up. Then, then it all made sense. Now, for the first time, I feel like things I watched and part of the undertones of the song come together in one place. Wow, I kind of like that. That's cool. Now, now, um, this is not to make a joke because, like I said, I, I don't know if uh, Phil there has been through the club. I, I, it feels like the, the, the one band played while we were still open, but I'm not sure. And, uh, my, my, before I make my jokes, because I mean, I mean, is this, is this walking around to be fashionable? This, is, this special appearance is, uh, artistic and, uh, yeah, it, I, mean, I want to hear if he's doing something, but I want to look into him. Uh, I, I like the shit he talks about. And, uh, when I was reading, uh, so when I read, uh, replaced for artistic and creative differences and stuff. I always flash back to the owner of the club and our discussion about how many of the bands literally were just current thing cult members, but would never want to admit it until the current thing became so strong that it, it um they had to take their sides. And it was funny because we, the last conversation I had with Brian was, we just couldn't, it was like, I didn't know. We didn't know. Like, like I'll tell you this, half the time the lyrical content was just current. They, it was just fake, right? It was whatever they thought the fan base who would keep buying, you know, paying them. Because behind the scenes, it's it's like some of those lies, right? They say one thing, but boy, they, don't, they, don't, they don't walk to talk. They don't, you know. They write a lot of checks. They're right, you know, ass can't catch, cash type deal. And uh, when I see that whole, like, like the drummer here, <clears throat> it's not that I don't like some of the tunes from. I think that this is the right guy, right? Uh, from the band he was in, but that seemed like such a petty move. Oh, yeah. I agree that the cult is really hard to deal with. But then, hey, look at me. Doomsday clock exists my whole life. I was supposed to hire, you know, it's all been, whoa, bright eyes get me all worked up. It shouldn't, it's too chill. But I, I am familiar with what he does on the other side of things. Okay. Of course, now I've been listening to me like two minutes to midnight and all right, you know, the whole Watchmen and when it was just a comic book. Uh, uh, yeah, no. Very cool. Phil, it's good acting. 
Is, but why are you saying uh, it's a little back up there at the end? I am going to search into his other music and figure some stuff out because it's weird. I, I finally have. I didn't realize I was so interested in uh, his personal views on life. I got to see how much of the music I appreciate. Tell my, uh, yeah, I, this is the third one I've seen. I think it's uh, decent stuff. Pretty sure I covered it all. I, uh, I hope he just keeps going, growing. And, uh, as he balances on that center fence, I hope he can laugh his way to on both sides and all the way to whatever he wants to build for himself. Been one of the more impressive things I've watched over the last, uh, decade. Cause yeah, I mean, I can go back to when they were, <clears throat> It's like Luke, others. Uh, I can go back to when they like first, I've been watching them for so long when they're on the street doing their shit or working for someone else. Yeah, hey, very cool. Later. <laughs>